guys! Today I'm gonna be doing a video that I don't ever do. I've never done a video like this and I have said that I was going to, which this is gonna be my first one. I will be doing a wig review on this wig. Um, if you guys want to learn about this wig, where I got it, what I'm doing with it, how I'm rocking it, pros and cons, then keep on watching. Alright, hi guys. So, today I'm going to be reviewing this wig. So, um, I bought this wig at my local beauty supply. I was going to order on this website, but I'm really impatient and I didn't feel like waiting. So I just bought it online. I mean, on, at my beauty supply. The wig, this wig is from the Janet collection and it is the, um, it's called the... Part Lace Devisa Wig by the Janet Collection. Um, it is in the color 1B, which is like off black. It does have an uh, L-shaped um, parting, if you can see that. I did put some concealer just to make it look a little more realistic. Um, I am going to be turning this wig into a U-part wig because I like exposing my natural hairline just because it's more or less wiggy and it makes me feel a little bit more comfortable that people aren't going to like think it's a wig. I mean, people who don't know me, obviously, one day I don't go from short hair to, like, long weave, you know? Like, this wig is, like, I think it's almost, maybe it's, like, 22 inches, 23, around there, maybe. I got it at my beauty supply for $54. Um, this is a synthetic Futura fiber wig, meaning you can, like, put heat onto it, at to up to a level of 350 degrees um, I personally I have you know in the past put heat on synthetic wigs like for Turo wigs but it literally doesn't help at all I mean it helps for that second but I say I say stick with the original wig don't do anything to it because then afterwards um, it's gonna start getting dry and it's gonna look less natural and um, I don't plan on doing anything to this wig. I just plan on maintaining its like flow. You know how like you can see how flowy it is and like how it moves with me. Um, most wigs when I do try to flat iron them and stuff they'll get like really stiff at the ends and then they'll just like be like really stiff like you see all that movement. Um, that wouldn't happen with my other wigs. I love it. I fell in love with it the first time I put it on. Um, but yeah. Um, the parting is nice, I think. Um, I still think, I mean, if from my opinion, I still think it looks kind of wiggy. Um, but yeah, I mean, I'm pretty sure some of you girls out there who are guys, um, uh, know how to, like, conceal that. Now let's get into the pros and the cons about this wig. Pros, obviously, it's a beautiful, beautiful haired wig. It has beautiful hair. It's so soft, so silky. Um, first day putting it on, you're gonna be obsessed. Like, it's gonna be the best thing ever. Like, I felt like a freaking goddess. Like, I was going out that night. And I felt fucking amazing. Like, I was feeling myself. And it was amazing. Another pro, I guess the length. It's really long. And I personally love long hair. Um, it's... Um, just the thing that I like. Um, I think it looks more feminine. I mean, some girls can really rock that short haired look, but personally, me, because I have a round head and um, I was, I'm a man, um, it is like you know, kind of hard to rock a short hairdo, which is why I wear wigs. Because, um, once my hair gets like up to here. I'm gonna be like, no, not letting it out. I'm gonna start probably wearing extensions or something because I don't wanna go through that, honestly. I don't wanna have hair that's like like this short. Like, that's just gonna look so ugly. Like, let me see if I can mimic it. I can mimic the hair that's gonna be that one. Like, you see that? That's, I feel like it's gonna look so ugly. Those are the pros. Um, it's at a kind of affordable price. I mean, obviously, if you go order it online, you can obviously get it for a really cheaper price. Um, I will be linking it down below on the website that I look at my wigs, um, like when I want to purchase them online, which I have never actually, but, um, I heard so much about this website and I heard it's really good, so I guess you guys should try it out before I do, if you guys want to. Now let's get to the cons. The cons. Girl. 
for me, if you are a plus-sized woman, um, you know, sometimes we use our hair as a form of, you know, slendering or looking more thinner. Um, so this, personally, does not have a lot of hair. And this is all the hair that is given. I don't have anything in the back. This is all the hair that's given. Like, this is literally, like, like, it seems like a lot, but I personally want more. Like, I want to have enough hair that where I can do this to the front and still have hair in the back, you know? Another really, I don't know if this is only my wig, I've seen other reviews, they say it's minimal, I'm like, girl, this happens to me all the time. Like, okay. Uh, I recently cleaned my brush, my comb that I use to like brush my hair and stuff, and I took out all the extra hair that was in it that wasn't this one, and I've only brushed my hair with with, I've only brushed my, this wig with this comb, and look how much hair it has. Like, it's literally, like, if you can see that, it's literally full of hair. Like, I can, I can, um, pull some hair out right now, watch. Like, I'm just putting my hair through. Look at all that hair. Let me see if I can crumple it out. Like, look at all that hair. Like, why does it shed so much? Um, it's literally, it's shedding way too much, and it doesn't even have that much hair to begin with. So if it's shedding hair, it's not, you know, no, honey. Um, but yeah, um, that's another, that's, I guess that's the only con I have. Other than that, this wig is gorgeous. It's beautiful. I feel feminine. I wish it was thicker, but I'm pretty sure for a regular, you know, day-to-day -day girl, not no, you know, little drag queen over here, a little transgender woman over here, um, you wouldn't have a problem, but... Um, if you do have a bigger face, then it, it does kind of suck. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like down below. Let's get this video to 50 likes. Um, uh, it'll be really greatly appreciated. Um, but yeah, I love you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully this video was helpful for some of you out there who do want to purchase this wig and just wanted to know a little more about it. I mean, I always do it. I always look up my things before I buy them and then I'm like, all right, let's get it. If I'm, if I'm, if the person who got it is in love. <sighs> Anyways, if you guys want to see this makeup tutorial, it is going to be my next video. So stay tuned, subscribe. I love you. Have a fabulous day. Hey guys, welcome to another video from Caesar Ochoa. If you didn't know my full name, that's my full name. My last name sounds like you're sneezing. Like, I remember in fourth grade, one of my teachers, he used to always call me Caesar Ochoa, and I'd be like, you're stupid.